Welcome to another feature release by us at Zenla. So now to give you the ability to sort and file all of your media that you create on the site, we have added tagging. So it's gonna mean that you can find and you can actually sort media based on tags. So this was a highly anticipated new feature by you guys for the ability to be able to organize your files. So we've now implemented that. So I'm gonna jump straight into the platform now and I'm gonna show you these new changes. So if we go to site and into our media library, you're gonna see that we have all our media and you're gonna see this new little thing that says tag. So now what we can do is we can actually tag a media file. So I'm gonna take one of these, doesn't matter what it is, it could be an image, could be a um, PNG, PowerPoint presentation, a zip file, and you can do all this exactly the same way. So we're gonna come in here, I'm gonna pretend this is course A. So you're gonna see now that we have this ability in here to add tag. So I'm gonna come in here, and I'm gonna put in here course, and then one, and I'm gonna hit enter. Now you can also add multiple tagging. So if I wanted to add another tag for this, I could add another tag there and hit enter, and I'm gonna have two tags. So now I'm gonna click update, and you're gonna see in the media library now, we have this new tagging system. So this means that we can now filter our tags. So if I'm looking for just that tag, I can filter based on that. So I can select a tag, come in here, let's choose course one, and then the filter is going to apply and give us only the media that has got those tags in it. For instance, also if I pick tag two. So let's go back now to um, unfiltered and I'm going to put in another one on this one. I'm going to call it course two and we will filter on that. So if I come in there now, you can see handily we have all the tags dropping down. I'm going to choose course two there. And we're going to click update to that and come back into the media library. And now we have this one here. So again, I can sort just on that, should give me two files. You can see I can sort this really easily by just going into there and selecting these tags. Now also we have the ability in here to bulk tag. So if I select all these, for instance, I can come into here and I can choose a bulk action. I can remove a tag, I can add a tag. Now not just for all of the files that are in here, but I can also do it for certain files that I want to tag. So I'm selecting these files here. I'm going to choose a bulk action to add a new tag. And we're going to call this course three. And I'm going to click add. It's three, hit enter and add. And you're going to see it's going to now be applied only to those ones that were checked. Now we can also remove tags in bulk. So if I want to remove, say, course three, I can come in here, select all of them if I want to, come in here for the bulk action and remove tag. And I can come into here, and I can select the removal of this tag and click remove. And now you're going to see that all of them have been removed from course three. So this is going to give us a really good way to be able to sort our files out and organize them per course. And I know this was a highly anticipated feature. So now we have released this ability to be able to do this.